Hello everyone, today we're playing Freddy Fazbear's Pizza Simulator. My brother wanted me to play it. Don't know how this is go, but looks like a pretty nice 8-bit minigame. Let's see how we do this. Okay. Mm, I, I want to design a pizza. What do I want on my pizza? I normally like... Nah, I don't like sausage. I'm gonna just take pepperonis. Mushrooms, olives. I'm good with that. Let's go down. Let's go to the pizzeria. Alright, let's collect these. Alright, shift to uh, throw. Okay. I'm gonna turn down the volume a bit because this is a bit loud. These are nice pizzas. Notice that they're just pepperoni. Uh, no other toppings. You would think. Well, there we go. First stage done. Alright. Each child requires three pizzas, which seems a bit excessive. But, I can handle it. Ah. Bread man. Alright. That's how we're gonna do it. So we're gonna feed him three. Now we're gonna try and feed all the children. Seems like it worked. I'm gonna go up here. And there we go. Oh wait, does he only need one pizza? Seems like it. Yep, we could have saved it there. Ah! He didn't disappear. Okay! This is a wee bit weird. Let's give him all pizza! This is gonna be a good time. Wow. Yikes! I think I'm gonna die! What? Alright. Either the game crashed, or something else. Hello, ma'am. How are you? Okay. Let's play this Begin recording. Begin tape. Leaving dead space. Three, two, one. The purpose of this tape is to test automated response times and reactions from vintage interactive attractions following audio stimuli. Okay. If you are playing this tape, that means that not only have you been checking outside at the end of every shift, as you were instructed to do, but also that you have found something that meets the criteria of your special obligations under paragraph 4. Okay. Follow these instructions, document response times, then safely secure the space before leaving. Upon sealing the room, you are not to return. Begin okay. audio call in 3, 2, 1. Let's see what's happening. Document results. Yeah. Uh, Begin audio prompt in three, two, oh. one. Oh, I just have to click it. I don't have to do anything. I'm gonna make sure. Document results. She doesn't do anything to me. Begin audio prompt in three, two. One. There we go, I documented enough results. Can't really read it well, so I don't know what I actually clicked. But, yeah, I think it's good enough. Hey. Boop, boop. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three. Two. Oh? One. Hey. Boop. Hey. And did something bad happen? No. It's a new day. It's All right, time we're okay. Shine. It's time to take your career into Good. your own hands. You've saved money your whole life. Great. Yes, I did. Now nice. I was responsible one investor. And take a huge gamble on your future. Oh. A gamble that comes with a 100% chance of success in some cases. Does it? 
What are we talking in about? In some cases. We're talking about becoming a Fazbear Entertainment franchisee. That's that right. pretty cool. Restaurant ownership and management. Something almost anyone can do with a limited degree of success. Really? Sure, it's oh. a lot of money to limited invest, success. but everyone's doing it. And that means it's safe and lucrative. Really? With your initial investment, you'll receive everything you need to get started, including a small room, some tables, and electricity. But don't forget about the money um. you had left over after buying your franchise package. Use it to decorate, buy a stage, buy attractions and animatronics, and Ooh, much, much more. Ooh, buy stuff. Nice. Now, let's take a look at a few things that will help you get started as a fast right. entertainment what are the pro tips? Such as atmosphere. Okay. Making sure your establishment has an inviting atmosphere is essential to bring All in right. customers. Alright, yep, the cheese is real. Entertainment. Having a lot of entertainment value in your restaurant will ensure that customers come back. Nice. Bonus revenue. Coin-operated games and attractions can generate additional <laughs> revenue during the day, oh. which means more money okay. in your pocket. Ready for reinvestment. This reminds me of Wall Health Street and safety. There may be times when you purchase something of questionable quality. And oh. And blame you. Cutting corners is just good business. Okay, is it though? Take to ensure you don't get sued for it. And that brings us to liability. Being a thrifty shopper is smart, but be aware that buying things oh. on sale comes with a I, I don't want to die, though. Aside from the daily risk of lawsuits, there's also the risk that something might be hiding inside whatever you just purchased with that steeply discounted price tag. Of course, oh. that would only be a serious danger if there were something outside that's been trying to get in for months now, which we are not confirming to be the case. Okay. This the amount of help we are legally obligated to provide. Remember, you are now the face of the newly rebranded Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Wear that smile with pride and let's make some money. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for disappearance, death, or dismemberment. I think I'm going to die. I'm gonna click. All right. Use clock alarm. Da, ba, ba, ba. Use catalog mode to purchase items, animatronics, and other supplies. Okay, okay. Use blueprint mode to place items, upgrade items, and upgrade your floor plan. Okay. I'm ready. Let's hop into it. Zero dollars. See how much cash you had left over after purchasing your franchise package. Great. That's $100? more than enough. Now let's get that started. Is a... On your left are your product catalogs. You can unlock more expensive catalogs by simply purchasing items for your pizzeria. Use the arrows in the bottom right of the item window to browse the products for each catalog. When you're finished shopping, <sighs> this just seems like it's going to blueprint mode to break place apart. your items. You can switch back and forth between catalog mode and blueprint mode as often as you like before opening your doors to the public. Okay. When you're ready to open your restaurant for business for the day, click the button labeled finished in blueprint mode. Give it a try and do some shopping. Okay. I kind of want to buy this. I like fan. Let's buy that. That seems pretty nice. Why is Mr. Can Do not available? <laughs> I feel like he would be a nice. Oh, wait. I think I am gonna need a stage. Let's see if I can get Mr. Can Do. Bucket Bob. Yeah. I can do so, so can you. Alright, what do we have left over? Ah, I don't have enough for the duck pond. Is there anything else? Mr. Hugs. I don't trust him. He has some liability. Light animatronics, okay. I'm just gonna buy the paper. Pals. They seem pretty nice. I don't have enough for that. Cups. Yeah, I'm gonna buy this. They look cool. Alright. Let's see what we can design. <laughs> oh, 
Okay. So, I don't know if I wanna... Oh wait, I used WS and AR. restaurant is now officially open okay also, that doesn't mean your job is finished however you have a lot of work to do while patrons eat their pizza in the other room From oh, the terminal, you have supplies to okay buy, papers to print and repairs to make once you've taken care of all the items on your to-do list you can log off for the day and get out of there money for supplies and repairs comes out of petty cash so don't worry about it coming out of your pocket we've got you covered the only money you have to worry about is if you choose to upgrade any of the equipment in your office. Okay. Now, on to other matters. Something to be aware of is that the ventilation system and your terminal are pretty loud and may prevent you from hearing things in adjoining air vents. That won't be a problem if there is nothing in the vents. However, if you feel that something might be in the vents, you have a few tools at your disposal to protect yourself. You can shut off your terminal and the ventilation system at any time to decrease the amount of attention you are drawing to yourself. Also, shining your light directly into a vent will most likely prevent anything from jumping out. You also have three tools available from the terminal itself. There is a motion detector, an okay. audio decoy, and a secondary ventilation unit. Keep in mind, however, that you can only is. have one of these active at any given time. Okay, only one active at a time. It. Simply log off when you've completed your tasks for the day and you can go get some coffee. Yeah, I'm just gonna buy the stuff. Hopefully no one jump scares me. I don't think there is anyone because we didn't take on any extra liability. Anything happening motion detecting? Doesn't seem like it. probably be good for this night. We didn't take on any liability, so there shouldn't be any animatronics. I wonder if I can... Yep. The boops are always nice. Oops. Didn't mean to look wet. We got the whole Freddy gang up there. But kind of looks like Lefty. If I'm not mistaken. All we gotta do is maintenance and clog the toilets. Okay. This does not feel like a secure office. But it's okay for now. Maybe we'll be able to upgrade it later. Right. For this playthrough, I'm just gonna try and play everything safe. I do not feel like having to actually try. Uh, I can't throw those. Hmm. Yeah, we didn't find anything on the motion detector. So, I think we're good. Let's Great log job. Off. It looks like you're getting the hang of this. Hey. Now let's just focus on getting you through your first week. Let's There's see how much party we got. here Saturday. Okay. And you should view that day as your ultimate test. Make it through Saturday, and you will have proven yourself as the successful entrepreneur that we all know you can be. Okay, okay, I'm an entrepreneur. I can do this. Oh. Congratulations on completing your first day. However, Thanks. your job isn't over just yet. There is another oh. aspect to your end-of-day routine, and that is inspecting and salvaging any animatronics found in the alley outside the back door. Okay. We're around here quite often, and while we aren't sure why, what we do know is that they can be used for parts, which can mean 
a much needed revenue boost before starting your next day. Okay. Of okay. course, as with everything else in this I line of work, extra money, I'm those good. benefits come with risk. The safest thing to do is to throw it back outside, but then you get no money for the salvage. Choose to keep it, and you run the risk of certain negative consequences, namely uh. death. Should the uh. question not be as docile as it first appeared? If yeah. you do decide I to try to salvage it, then you must complete the maintenance checklist. During this testing phase, check on the animatronic frequently. If you feel that it is becoming unstable, use the taser provided to you. You can use it three times without damaging the hardware. Every use over three, however, will decrease the item's salvage value. Before you is an animatronic found in the back alley. We are unsure of its origins. It okay. is your job to complete the maintenance checklist before claiming it as salvage. Or, if you choose to, you can throw it back into the alley where you found it and forfeit payment. Please make your choice now. Do I want to throw it back? That's like a cool five hundred dollars. It's five times what we started out with. We can probably get that double stage and stuff, so we can get some cooler animatronics. I'm gonna risk it for the best. Get. You have chosen to proceed with the maintenance checklist. Remember. Use your company-issued taser to return the animatronic to a neutral state if you feel that it's becoming unstable or aggressive. You can only use it three times before it begins to damage the animatronic and decrease its value. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. I have my finger right on the find it button, and I'm ready to shock it whenever. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, Demon. one. Feels like he's sitting up straighter. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. I'm gonna shock him. Document results. Yep, he did move. And he's right back up. Begin okay. audio prompt in three, two, one. I think there's going to be an extra stage. Document results. Begin audio one. Wrong button. Yep, I'm just shaking him. I do not trust that. Let's see the audio prompt. We still got one more shot. So we're all results. You have completed the maintenance checklist and may proceed with the salvage. Well done. End tape. Alright. Alright. That's a wee bit creepy. But we got 500. Okay.
I'm ready to take the risk. Special, especially with uh, can you bob? All right. Ah, oh, we got a free hundred dollars. Alright, we're gonna look at the stats real quick. One zero four one. Ah, that boosted our revenue. No, 
most of the path. Out of bounds. Okay, I'm a little bit confused with that. But we also got a hundred dollars on it. Ooh, I can play test the balloons. Okay, I won. <laughs> nice. Alright, I'm gonna finish up with our play tokens. I'm gonna play test this another time because I like it. I'm gonna see what that secret in the bottom was. Okay, move it. Move it. Speed now. Disobeying all traffic laws, swerving, and we lost a lot of speed there, but that's okay. Alright, lap one. Let's see if we can not get hit in this lap. Find out what the secret is. This seems cool. Ah! Alright, we're still driving. This music is a bop. I really like it. Who do you think we are? Just driving. It's raining. Don't know where we're going. Well, that would technically be alright. Hey, we're at Junior's. Hey there, mister. Come on. You know you can't be here. Don't make this more difficult than it has to be. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna hop back in my car. See what the other route takes me. This time we'll make another right hand turn. Alright, let's re position ourselves. This is getting a wee bit funky. Uh, what's over here? Ah, I guess this is our house. Wow. Pixels, nice. Let's see where it. No, we can't go in the bushes. Unfortunate. We can get like right on top now. Alright, let's go inside. Hey there, buckaroo. Why are you watching TV? Oh. Well, sorry. This way. Okay. Open the door, I guess. Will I? No. I guess I will have to find a way to the outside. Yeah, well, you're liking the TV. Well. Let's try and get a run back. Okay, we can just walk through that. Wow, 
this house is much bigger than I thought it was. An extra hundred. What's this sponsorship? No, I don't want a sponsorship. No thanks. I'm gonna be all on my own. Oh, wait, we can add that uh, slot to this. More revenue. Nice. I like this one. It reminds me of Pac Man. and stuff was. Also, who's this person in the background? scared me. Okay. Time extended. Let's go down this way. Get over there. Ah, that bunny's scaring me. Hmm. I wonder if we can get all the fruit. extra time. Rabbit is freaking me out. You already almost gave me a heart attack once. <laughs> Alright, I think that's the end of us. Well, I feel like that was a pretty good run. And I feel like I'm done for right now. So, thanks for watching. Remember to like and subscribe, that's the end.